Welcome back to Space Engineers, folks. We are pretty much ready to head out into space. I did add a little bit to the uh, the ship. I don't think I did that on camera. So I added some lights, some reversing lights, some landing lights for the miner, some uh, forward lights, so that we can see what's going on out in space. So yeah, so we need to hook the miner up to the ship. It's fully loaded with hydrogen. We need to... I, I did put a couple of assemblers on there. So I think I'll... I'll grab a little bit of iron and other stuff. Uh, let's grab some nickel as well. Maybe not that much. 3,000 and some iron and some silicon maybe a bit of silver and some gold as well I don't have any cobalt uh, hmm I don't really think I have anything else that I want to bring. Don't think there's anything in this container. No. Is there anything over here? There certainly is. Uh, let's bring a bit more gold. Bring what little cobalt and magnesium we have. I already have some gramble for food, so I think that's about it. So let's stick all that in here. There we go. So we have some stuff to repair with. I found a nice place for the uh, assemblers right here. It, they are connected to something, to our conveyors here. So they should be hooked up to everything. One on each side, just fit into that hole right there. So that was perfect. And that means that we need to get our miner on here. Oh, and I did, uh, so we have, here we have reverse camera, and then I want down camera uh, view, so that we can uh, look down and see when we're landing. So let's... Head over here. Um, something like that. Look down. Where is... What way is what here? Okay. So there and... Come over that way. Come down a bit. So we're not up too high. Let's do the reverse view instead. Okay, we're docked, 
and ready to get out of here. I did widen the hole quite a bit so that we should be able to get out, hopefully. And the only problem we have is that we have a visitor up here. Strike drone mark two. Which I'm hoping will go away. Go away. I don't like you. It is moving away, but I think it's here to stay. It's just kind of milling about, waiting for me to come out. So, you know, it stopped, and I'm guessing it's going to come back. Yeah, see, it's turning, turning, and moving back. It's just kind of patrolling here. Which sucks. Because we need to get this big bad boy out and into space. Well, the first thing we need to do anyway is... Oh, I already set all this up. So we don't need to do that. I thought I needed to set up the... Um, the controls. But if we come out and then just get up to speed as fast as we can towards Earth. Hopefully we're okay. Let's quickly uh, flee. Okay. Get in here. Because I am actually ready to go. Come on. Get get in the seat. Oh, before we get in the seat, let's close the door. We're pressurizing here, so we I should be able to take off my mask without taking damage. Yes, I am. Nice. So we'll turn uh we'll unlock and turn those on so now we're going i'm hoping i'm not Destroying my miner up there. All right, we're out into space and we need to turn our uh, inertial dampeners off. We're doing a hundred, but we need to do a hundred this way. So let's do that. Okay. We're out of here. Bye-bye, moon. Doesn't seem like I destroyed anything, so that's nice. Very nice. We are off to find some cobalt and... Everything else that we need, cobalt being the main thing, magnesium being the second thing, and then I guess platinum. All right, let's turn the hydrogen engines on so that we don't spend our battery power. If we turn them off, how much battery power do we have? Two days. Okay, fine. All right. We're out of here. I 
heading straight for Earth. Actually, we need to GPS. We can turn uh, this one off. Uh, cobalt. Let's show that. First moon landing. We can turn that off for now. We can turn that off. We can turn that off. Then we can turn that on. All right. So let's head in that direction. And we'll head towards uh, the base because we know that there's cobalt and stuff like stuff there. But if we can find some, um, some asteroids with stuff on them instead, that would be preferable. Uh, silver, nick, iron. I need to turn those GPSs off as well. Uh, no, no. All right. Well, there's an asteroid. So we'll head towards that. Not straight towards it, but somewhat towards it. Actually, turn our engines off for now. Okay, we need to come a little bit more over. Like that, just so we have a general direction towards the asteroid there. Oh, that looked like it came closer a very, very fast all of a sudden. Asteroids showing up. This is my uh, ore detector. Let's turn that up. A lot of asteroids showing up here. Commercial dampener is on. Oh, I need my helmet on, might be an idea. Let's see if there's any resources here. Oh, I need to turn my, um, might be an idea to turn my, my turrets on. 
There's something here. It's not cobalt though. That's iron. Don't see any. No. Let's get back in our ship. And I want to turn my turrets on. Okay. And turn my inertial dampeners off and just get up to speed. I guess we'll head towards that asteroid there. So which which one is my turrets here? Dropship turrets nine. Let's turn you on. There are quite a few enemies quite close to us, which I don't like, so I think we will drop that asteroid and just head towards the base. Just try and get a bit of distance between us and, uh, and the enemies here. Right, moving towards home base. And so really what we need to, to do is go get that cobalt and uh, magnesium and head back to, to the moon. That's the plan right now anyway. Are we getting a bit of distance between us and the enemies? We can only see one now, but it's quite steady in its distance from us. It's getting a little bit away. 2.27. 1, 2.28. It's not, it's not exactly uh, moving away at a lightning pace, I'd say. It's a big asteroid. Head towards that a little bit. 2.29. Oh, there came another one, but that was like eight kilometers away. Is that one or multiple asteroids? I guess it doesn't really matter, but there's a lot of. Uh, a lot of material there so there might be some resources exiled engineer is talking to me don't know what kind of trouble I've been causing I know I'm trying to been trying to mind my own business, really. 2.32 kilometers. Right. We'll, we'll come to a stop here real quick. And whoa, look at that. He is coming in so fast. We'll not come to a stop here. Let's just move. Is that guy? It's back there, corrupt salvage drone. I would have liked to check out that asteroid, but 
I guess we won't be doing that. But we're going at a pretty good pace towards home, so I can live with that. I think I'll just get us a little bit closer to home or put a bit of distance between us and the enemies and then uh, I'll be back because just watching me hang out here is is not the most exhilarating stuff in the world so I'll be right back right so we are a bit closer to earth and we have a couple of asteroids pretty nearby and I don't see the corrupt salvage drone anymore I see the dangerous encounter but that's the only enemy around right now so I am going to fly over here and check out uh, this asteroid, see if there's any anything we want here. Doesn't look like it. No, nope. it's just a big rock. Let's head to this one as well. I thought that was one closer. Uh, where's my ship? It's there. Oh, it's that one that's closer. So let's head here. And see if there's anything. It doesn't seem like there's much on these asteroids. I don't see anything. Head in here real quick. No. Hmm. All right. I guess we'll keep traveling towards Earth. All right. We are getting closer to home. We are around 52 kilometers out. We are in planetary gravity. We have 0 0.23 planetary gravity. Uh, you can see that. We just uh, how, how do I show you that uh, where where it is it's down at the bottom on the toolbar so left to all my icons down there you can see a gravity and P gravity <laughs> so P gravity is planetary gravity so we're we're in planetary gravity a little bit and we are around 20 kilometers up from the planet We've only used 15% of our hydrogen to get this far, which is really nice. And pretty soon we'll be home. So very, very cool. All right, we are getting closer to home. We are around 25 kilometers out, 26 kilometers out. And I think that's actually our lake we can see down there. I think that's our lake that we can see down there. We're in 0 0.36 planetary gravity, and we have now used 17% of our fuel, 18, which is not a whole lot. But we are certainly getting closer to home. and breathable air and everything like that. It's wonderful. This is some mountains we're in with our home base. Look at that. Suppose it's instead of moving the entire ship around, it's easier to just move the view around. Look at those mountains. I don't think there's a bit of flat around. Base 18 kilometers out. I'll see you when we're basically there. All right, 
We are about five kilometers out from uh, home base and around three kilometers out from a outpost down there, a not friendly one. So we'll try to give that a bit of a wide berth. And I think it's time to turn our inertial dampeners on. Uh, maybe not. Let's just head towards home. Now it's time. There we see our base. It looks intact. It looks intact. Well, that's kind of nice. And let's come in for a nice, soft, preferably touchdown. That base isn't too far away, is it? Um, hmm. Where do we want to land? I want to be kind of close to the base so that I'm protected. Because the base has pretty decent defenses up on the roof. Well, so does the ship, to be honest. So, oops, that's not what I wanted to do. Mm. How's this spot right here? It looks safe enough, kinda. Let's come down. And lock, turn off our engines. All right. We are on Earth. We are back at our home planet, guys. That is pretty sweet. Yeah, and everything is intact here. Very, very cool indeed. Now, we do have a miner here, don't we? Or did that get destroyed? No, we do have a miner. It's not the greatest. Might want to redesign that. But we have cobalt and we have magnesium. Magnesium is right over there. We have cobalt over there somewhere. So yeah, we're we're pretty well off. We have our nice ship here. I think it's nice anyway. It got us home safe. And we have our Miner there, what, what? Potassium? It said. No, oh, it's here in this uh, crater. Alrighty, I am very happy about being home safe and sound. For now, anyway. We do need to do something about the base over there, though. We really do. Let's see, how much cobalt do we actually have in uh, in storage? Uh, hmm, hmm, hmm. Cobalt. We have... 35,000 or so. What about magnesium? 140. Magnesium is a bigger problem, so we need to mine some magnesium quick so that we can make some ammo. And then we'll go after cobalt after that.
but yeah we are back at our base that we built in uh, season one and we didn't complete it there's still stuff to do here but it's it's home it's home and next time we will uh, start doing some well, maybe we'll do some mining maybe we'll try and clear out that outpost we'll see which which comes first and and then once we're uh, stocked up on cobalt and uh, magnesium we'll uh, we'll head back to the moon, to our moon base so thank you very much for watching guys i hope you enjoyed it if you did, why not leave a like and subscribe and I'll see you next time.